Let's begin by going to our project panel, creating an adjustment layer, then dragging it above our two clips on the timeline. Move your playhead directly between where your two clips meet, and then move back 10 frames by holding shift and hitting the left arrow key twice. Now make a cut by holding control and pushing K, and then delete the outside layer. Move your playhead back to the center and do the same thing. Move ahead 10 frames and then make a cut, deleting the outside layer again. Under Effects, find Lens Flare and drag it onto the adjustment layer. From the beginning of the layer, under Effect Controls, click the stopwatch animation icon under Flare Center and Flare Brightness. Now using the X and Y position controls, Move the flare center so that's in the top left corner of your screen. Move the playhead to the center of the two clips, and then move your flare to the top middle of the screen. Now move to the end of the layer, and move the flare center so that it's in the top right. Now that we have our basic effect in place, we need to make it brighter. Move your playhead to the start of the layer, and change the brightness to zero. Now we want to move to the center again by hitting this arrow, then change the brightness to 300. Finally. Move to our last keyframe at the end of the layer and change the brightness back down to zero. What we have now is a nice, light leak transition effect.